This is it, man. This is the finale of this whole Viego saga. Oh, Senna. She's back, baby. I love the teamwork. And there's that classic hero shot that I always talk about in filmmaking. Damn, take the shot, boy. Oh! I don't know who that character is, though. Who just shot? It's cool, though. This is sort of the climax of this green dark green aesthetic they've been building up through all these videos look at the color palette it's changed from this dark green and blues to this beautiful gold warm feeling it's it's a cool symbol because it's kind of like what a metaphor like you know he 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 lost his step in the dance he, he's fallen off the rhythm and you know he can't hold to her uh her her purity anymore like she's still pure she's still untarnished and he's like lost himself look at this beautiful composition starting from her head over here Beautiful. It kind of draws your eye to Senna. What is this place that he's bringing? That is this like his original kingdom? He won't take the shot until he kind of gets consent. See, she she looks at him. Let me rest. So what a what a powerful way to end it with these two embracing. Contrast to that, these figures falling apart. It's it's a video that is um is not gonna be confusing on the first watch but will be rewarding if you watch it on a second time. Hello, my name is Philip. I'm a filmmaker, and today we're going to be watching and reacting to Absolution, Sentinels of Light, 2021 Cinematic League of Legends, and analyzing the cinematic language. We've had a ton of fun going through all of the recommendations that you guys have given me in the YouTube comments, including Final Fantasy XIV, this League of Legends saga, which has been so much fun, as well as Overwatch and a bunch of other stuff. So thank you so much. Please keep up the recommendations and please keep uh, explaining the lore to me in the comments. I've learned so much about all these different games, which um, I've only seen the cinematics of. So it's super cool for you guys to fill in what I might have missed in some of the gameplays. So thank you for that. And guys, if you've been enjoying my Final Fantasy reactions, my League of Legends analysis, please make sure to subscribe. We're almost at 10,000 subs here on my second YouTube channel. So make sure to drop a like. Let's get it done. And guys, come over to Twitch if you want to chat live. Um, it's a lot of fun, and you can talk to me about this stuff. And we're always talking about whatever game we're playing on Twitch in the same way that we analyze these videos. So make sure to stop by. That being said, let's get into this video and start the analysis. Let me know what your favorite League of Legends character is and what you want to see them add to the gameplay in League of Legends. All right, let's get into this. All right, here we go. Let's enjoy this. Absolution. I love this flower image. Oh, is this him and... I think... In the name of love. Oh. All the sacrifices that were made. Oh, that's him and his lover. Lives forever tainted. So we're getting some of the backstory of this villain. Ah, oh, there's that sword. Have driven good men mad. I like this. And mad men good. The no calm before the storm with this poem being read. Great. Really good move. We got all the heroes. Me. Oh, that's right, she was locked in that uh, in that necklace. I remember that, you guys told me. Yeah. His love. Oh! They pinned him down! Oh, that's great. Really cool choreography game. Oh, heck yeah. I love the teamwork, and there's that classic hero shot that I always talk about in filmmaking. That lower angle lensing. No! No! Oh my god! No! Is not easily dissuaded. Oh, he actually killed her. He actually killed her. What? Oh no, 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 no! He's not playing around. He's got her corpse. Oh, this is like high stakes. This is really high stakes. He's gonna take Senna. Oh no, not Senna! Don't you touch that hair. No. No. Show them no pity. Oh damn. They took Senna. Out of sight. And he's got backup. This is not good. Nobody here on a shirt. <laughs> That's funny. Mean you? Nobody here on a shirt. I love that. Dude, what? Where did he take Senna though? What is that place? Do you guys know? And this is him and his lover, right? Okay. Wow, really cool. I love how like this whole aesthetic that they've created is consistent throughout. Oh, no, 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 no. Viego. Viego. Your black and broken heart has destroyed everything. You turned our season of love. Yes. 
into an eternity of bitterness. Yeah, yeah, she doesn't like him anymore. All this death. Yep. All this ruination. Ruination. And for what? This obsession. She's she's I loved you until my final breath. Why wasn't that enough? Whoa. That's great. Our tragedy should have died with me. That's beautiful. Now she's renouncing him. Let me rest. Renouncing, yep. Damn, take the shot, boy. Oh! Oh, he's gonna be pissed at that guy. I don't know who that character is, though. Who just shot? I don't know who it is. No. No. Oh, Senna. She's back, baby. She's back, baby! Oh, man. They're locking him up. Whoa. What an image. Breaking free. It's cool though. This is sort of the climax of this green, dark green aesthetic they've been building up through all these videos. It's kind of like one big film, one short film put together. It's, it's great to see. And now we have this relief. Look at the color palette. It's changed from this dark green and blues to this beautiful gold, warm feeling. Like the danger is over. They can, you know, unlock in an embrace. Beautiful. That's great. And yeah, this is all the people that joined them along the way, like across the videos. I love that. Close them in there. Yeah. Man, that's great. What a tragedy. I love that she renounces him after all that. He's done. <gasps> Whoa. And it's just her alone now. Oh, that's cool. Like his figure was, was lost. That's beautiful. I like that. It's it's a cool symbol because it's kind of like what a metaphor. Like you know, he 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 lost his step in the dance. You know, he he missed the the message of their love. He lost his step in the dance, and now we have this. Uh, you know, he's fallen. He's fallen off beat. He's fallen off the rhythm, and you know he can't hold to her uh, her her purity anymore. Like she's still pure. She's still untarnished, and he's like lost himself. He's lost who he was and stuff. What, what a cool, what a cool metaphor. I love that. And wow, there's a lot to talk about here. But yeah, I just I love how this aesthetic kind of was brought to an end. Uh, everything makes sense. Who is this character though? I don't recognize that person. I don't know if he was in the other trailers. It could just be someone from the other trailers that has like a different outfit, and it's hard for me to recognize them. So I might have seen him in another cinematic. But I love what I see here. Yeah, a lot of great uh, sort of. What's the word? Uh, a lot of great visual cues that they've built up and a lot of audio cues as well. Like it was cool that they mentioned Ruination, uh, which is, you know, the original video where this guy appeared, Viego. And this was cool. I want to see this. This fight scene was really, really well done. A lot of great stuff going on here. I love how they set up all the um, sort of pieces on the board before they fight. Like, check this out. And a madman good. No this is it, man. This is the finale of this whole Viego saga. Like, let's get hyped. Let's enjoy this battle, this final confrontation. But I love it. It's like all the characters, all the per people that they built up, all their tools are coming together, all the teamwork uh, in a very meaningful way. And it's so cool to see. Like, okay, it's that guy's weapon. He's pinning him down with arrows. And then she goes ahead and does this, like, chain to keep him in place. But again, I got a comment on this hero shot. It's really good. And look at this beautiful composition. I love how Senna is actually in a crouching stance too. Because you have this beautiful line that comes down. And like sort of this triangle starting from her head over here. Beautiful. It kind of draws your eye to Senna. And her massive weapon right there. Look at this. Beautiful triangle if we follow along the, the top of their heads. It's great. Just a nice composition. Nicely lit as well from the back. Love that kiss lighting. Oh no. man, that is just so. Yeah, is is this character dead? Like, no, is she just not easily finished, or is she gonna be healed and back in it? 
Like, I don't know how they really, I don't know how seriously they treat death in League of Legends, or if it's like super, super absolute. But man, I mean, she got, she got run through. That's crazy. So, can somebody answer me? What, what is this place? No. Oh, this is Lucien. Lucien. What is this place that he's bringing? That is this like his original kingdom, uh, where he was with her? That's what it seems. Because the cool thing is, I like how he's stuck in there at the end. And now th this music box is this a part of the game? So cool. Your black and broken heart has destroyed everything. I love that. What what a what a great shot too. You have Senna and Lucian like reaching for each other and everything. This is beautiful, and you see the parallels, right? It's like their love is true, their love is pure, and then you have you know, uh, and and they want to be together and they do love each other. And you have Viego, and it's like you know, twisted. You turned lost our love. season of love into an eternity of bitterness. What a good what a good line. Season of love. All this eternity. death. All this. Yeah, great, great uh, sequence here with that sort of slow mo, just focusing on her speech, and you have this sort of struggle death. as she's talking about death and ruination and bitterness. And look at this, just all at war, people ruination. fighting for their loved ones, um, for fighting for survival, all because of him, all because of him trying to bring her back. And I love that it's highlighting like she doesn't want to come back if it means all this, right? This it's not worth obsession. it. Yeah. Beautiful. I loved you until my final breath. Man. Why wasn't that enough? I also love this. That this guy, like, even though there's all this horrible stuff happening, he still has like the respect uh and honor to to honor this moment. That's a really cool detail. He's honoring Our this moment. Tragedy should have died with me. He won't take the shot until he kind of gets consent. No. See? Let she she looks at him. Rest. Let me rest. And then he takes the shot right at her heart. Man. That's that's really beautiful detail. Just very well done filmmaking too. Like it, it's very clear what's happening. Like I said with the Overwatch videos, it's very clear what's happening here. They're not rushing it. They're not shoving a bunch of information down our throats. Like we see here in the shot selection, very clear. He kind of he kind of perks up. We go back to that one shot. No. He goes kind of like, wait, is she addressing me? Let me rest. Let me rest. We see he we see the uh, the line of sight between these two. He understands. He takes the shot reluctantly, and it's beautiful. No. And great, great sort of uh, animation. Like, what a great reaction shot of him there. You can see the pain. He really does look like Robert Carlyle, though. You guys know that actor. Great actor. No. Beautifully done. Senna takes that power back. Massive shot. I love, I gotta say too, I love how like all the characters have a hand in it. But I do love that Senna takes that shot. Like she's been in so many of these, uh, of these cinematics with him. And that, that she's been a big part of the struggle with V8. So it's cool. I like that she has a hand in his destruction, you know? Great. And like I said, this the aesthetic completely changes, you know. Oh okay, she is okay. Never mind. I missed that. She's fine. She's healed up. Yeah, I was gonna say you don't you don't usually see a, a hit like that in League of Legends cinema. You don't usually see somebody get like run through. Very intense. Oh. That's really great. Yeah. Kinda cool too. We get we do get the shot of everybody. Uh Okay, I love that. He goes to put his arm around her. She elbows him. It's great. And there it is, sort of this, uh, again, a, a different kind of hero shot. This being the everything's okay now. You know, we don't have to fight anymore. Everybody's in their kind of signature poses. You love that. And he's sealed in there. And yeah, if you guys let me know if I'm right on that, is that like his, his kingdom in there? And... Does anybody know, is this going to continue, or is this the finale of this entire saga? Because it's been, what, how many videos did we look at? Three, four, five, six? 
cinematics, I think. Just about this character, so. Really, really cool to see. Yeah. And like I said, what a, what a nice metaphor to finish it off. So, yeah, I, I have very high marks for this again. Um, it's, it's incredibly well done throughout. There's so many good... Uh, like I said, there's there's nice references to sort of just their own cinematic language that they've made throughout this saga that I, I would be curious. I bet if you were to watch all these back to back, it just feels like one film, one short film. I, I don't know what the runtime would be. I don't think it's going to be feature length if you combine them, but it's probably going to feel like a really robust short film. Is, are these scissors on her back? That's crazy. But yeah, um, really well done. Really well done. A lot of it is brought together again. The Lucian Senna uh, sort of romance, uh, wanting to just be together to be in peace, has been a huge narrative thread throughout this entire saga. So what a what a powerful way to end it with these two embracing, uh, who you know who wanted to be together so bad she was locked inside that mist. Right? What a powerful way to end it, and then to show this as the uh, the contrast to that. You know these these figures falling apart and not to be together ever again because of what he did what a what a beautiful contrast huh so yeah i think that's great again a lot of uh, a lot of nice metaphors coming together here it's it's a video that is um is not going to be confusing on the first watch but will be rewarding if you watch it on a second time i love going through them for that reason with you guys because we'll catch stuff like this and we'll catch a little bit of the deeper metaphors that they they thought about in the storyboarding and the writing and to see again that shot coupled with the uh, the sort of uh, music box, it's just really beautiful, really beautiful contrast. So anyways, thank you so much for watching, guys. I I don't know if this is the last one. I think it might be. It seems quite final. Um, but let us know. It's also called Absolution. You know, it sounds quite final. But let me know if there's going to be more in this saga. And guys, please, if there's new League of Legends. Uh, videos that come out and cinematics please let me know because i actually missed this one uh, by a day or two from when it came out uh, a good way to do that is to jump into my discord if you guys want to see me react to stuff you know right when it comes out let me know in the discord you can drop links as well and also come by twitch if you want to chat live that's a lot of fun and uh, you can find all those links on my twitch channel or elsewhere down in the top comment here but thank you so much guys for joining us make sure to subscribe we're going on 10k like i said and make sure to check out my other videos on this channel we have a lot of stuff um reacting to cinematics and if you want to learn martial arts and that sort of thing check out my main channel we're going on 190,000 subs and uh also instagram if you want to see my daily antics but thank you guys so much for being here have a great time and uh yeah see you around town